Welcome to my quick comparison of Kajabi versus Teachable. And it's kind of like hiring a full marketing team versus asking your cousin to build you a website on the weekend. Both get something online, but one's going to look a whole lot more professional. Now, before we dive deep, if you want to see who takes the early win and grab an exclusive extended 30-day free trial, there's a link waiting in the description and the pinned comment. So if you're looking to only upload a couple of videos and call it a course, Teachable is definitely going to be fine for you, as they do that pretty well and they have a lot of bells and whistles when it comes to creating your course. But the second you need your platform to actually run your business, not just hold your videos, you might be a little bit out of luck. And those high transaction fees, if you're just getting started with Teachable, yeah, nothing says welcome like losing a chunk of your first sales, and we'll talk about that a little bit more once we get into the pricing. And Kajabi, on the other hand, it's going to be more of your entire online business and one login. Courses, memberships, email marketing, funnels, landing pages, automation, pretty much the whole enchilada. No duct taping random tools together, and you don't have to pay for five different subscriptions, just one sleek platform running the show. So let's break down some of the biggest features and benefits when it comes to using each of the platforms. First is gonna be ease of use, and in my opinion, both are pretty solid here. Starting off with Kajabi, I do have to say there is going to be more to learn because they're an overall bigger software, in my opinion, overall, but it's definitely gonna be worth it once you have more control. As you can see on the left side here under products, not only do you have all products, you have your courses, your coaching, your communities, your podcast, your newsletter, your downloads, and you go down the sales with payments, offers, carts, invoices, coupons, affiliates, you have your website, there's even a branded app, then you have your marketing and you have your contacts. There's a whole lot to love when it comes to Kajabi. Overall, they do a pretty good job when it comes to getting up and running. But of course, when compared to Teachable, they are going to take a little bit more to learn given the fact they are much bigger and broader software overall. And as I talked about previously, if you want to throw some videos together and create a course, it is going to be super beginner friendly. You can build from scratch, you can generate from AI, and of course bulk upload if needed. Even building from scratch is pretty straightforward. We have our introduction model right here. We can save that. We can save that as well. And of course to edit it, let's click on it very quickly. And this is going to be the editor when it comes to creating your specific lesson. So all you have to do is click on the box that you want to utilize. Text and images, video, PDF viewer, audio, banner images, resources, code examples, quizzes, upsells, referrals, and so on and so forth. Everything that you're going to be needing is right here. And of course, you can enable comments or give it a public preview if needed, but there's not a whole lot going on there. Very straightforward and beginner friendly. Now let's very quickly talk about some of the features that you can expect from both. Kajabi, of course, you have courses, you have websites, email, funnels, landing pages, automations, podcasts, coaching. They have a whole lot to offer. It's pretty much a Swiss army knife of your online business. And this is just a very quick overview when it comes to creating a course. I do like their layout personally. I think it's clean, it's simple, it's intuitive. It is very straightforward. Your introduction, your modules, whether you wanna add no media, video, or audio, you can upload it right there. This is gonna be the text section, and of course you can add your downloads and a few other features that you can utilize when creating your courses. So I do have to say that Kajabi is going to look much more polished, especially when it comes to creating your courses, your landing pages, your funnels, and so on and so forth. And when we're talking about some of the features of Teachable, as you can see, being able to create products is going to be one. And depending on the plan you use, you can have a specific amount of them. They do have a lot of great features when it comes to creating your courses. And aside from that, you can see there's going to be a few things that you can do as well in terms of sales and marketing, like abandoned cart emails, coupons, upsells and order bumps, student referrals, an integrated affiliate program, depending on the plan that you pick, and some other customizations and integrations. But overall, in my opinion, nowhere even close to what Kajabi has to offer in terms of being an all-in-one platform. And that's simply because Teachable focuses more on being a course platform and having a lot of helpful features that accommodate with that as well. And speaking of the pricing plans, let's quickly compare those as well. So with Kajabi, it is going to be a higher monthly cost when you're getting up and running, but it will replace multiple tools. So anyone who's looking to just get started is going to be looking at $89 per month. But then on out, in my opinion, Kajabi is going to be the much better deal where you're looking at $149, $199, and $399. These pricing plans are going to be similar to Teachable. Speaking of that, let's check those out. 
As you can see, their starter is going to be a little bit lower, but the biggest thing here that I referred to earlier is the 7.5% transaction fee, which is a lot of money depending on what you're going to be selling and what you're using. So for a lot of people, they might be making so much in sales that this transaction fee is going to probably want them to steer either towards builder, growth, and advance. And these are going to be very similar pricing plans to Kajabi, but as I talked about previously, this makes it a much easier decision because Kajabi is a much bigger platform overall. They have more to offer. And when you're comparing these specific plans, which are all similar priced, I would say that Kajabi is the easy winner, especially for the fact that you're paying a similar amount, but you're just getting so much more in the process. So we had 89, 189, and 399. So you have 89, then it goes to basic for 149, but then growth and pro are gonna be pretty much identical, 199 and 399. And I said pretty much identical. So instead of 199, growth is going to be 189. So overall, they are very similar, but Kajabi just gives you much more value based upon the pricing plan if you're going to be using a much bigger plan in the first place. So all in all, there are going to be some pros and cons for each of these platforms because no software is going to be perfect. So with Kajabi, some of the pros is that it's all in one. It does have some stunning design with it. You get some powerful marketing tools and it can scale with you, which is fantastic. On the downside, it's gonna be a little bit higher upfront cost. So if you're looking to just get started as a beginner, you would be paying more. And there's gonna be a slightly steeper learning curve given the fact that it is a bigger software overall. It's just naturally going to be that way. Now we move on to the very quick teachable pros and cons. I do have to say that it is going to be easy for beginners and they do have a lower base price. However, with the limited amount of features they have, if you are just getting started on their first plan, you are gonna to have to deal with those higher transaction fees, which can take a good amount of money from your sales. So my take here, if you want your platform to grow with you and not against you, I think that Kajabi is the clear winner here. It's not just about hosting courses, it's about running your entire online business without feeling like an unpaid software juggler. So if you're ready to see why Kajabi takes the crown here, you can click the link in the description of the pinned comment and you'll get an exclusive extended 30-day free trial. It'll take you to a page that looks very similar to this where you can try it for yourself today. Test it, build with it, launch with it, and you can watch just how much smoother your business runs when everything's under one roof. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy.